I leave the rest in your capable hands, partner. Area man going to go ahead and consider that a date 27 year old lies about every single aspect of his life to keep parents from worrying. Area man too busy being quietly handsome to join party. Friend attempting to provide comfort has no clue what the fuck he's talking about. Area woman not listen to again. Artist starving for a reason. Co-workers at bathroom sink locked intense standoff over who going to wash hands longer. Disgusting bigotry. The media is only blaming this bat for coronavirus because he's a gamer. Gay couple has banal sex. Dog not sure how to interpret crazy dream where it saw squirrel. Barked at squirrel. Fact that man being criticized just goes to prove his point. Your honor. Friends of band regret going to show. Clavier fucking sucks. Gay teen worried he might be Christian. God answers prayers of paralyzed acrobat. No, says God. Group of friends chanting shots make compelling point. How? 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 9-11 was an inside job. I am under 18, but click it for first time in history of internet. What was I supposed to do? Lie? I can still cook this, right? Asks man holding up writhing, screaming potato with 8 foot long roots. I'm free, I'm finally free. Thinks parent before realizing lost child just hiding inside clothes rack. God damn it, Trucy, not this shit again. It instantly clear boyfriend used to fuck a Interpol agent being mentioned in anecdote. Wow, Miles, thanks for letting me know. Japanifornio blowjobless rate at all time high. Can I get a prayer? Jurisprudence fetishist gets off on technicality. Kids getting a little old to still believe in inerte caritable goodness of humans. 26 he rolled to see every asshole he ever solved a case with on night before Thanksgiving. Goodbye. Cleveland. Lack of sexual tension with co-worker almost unbearable. Pal. Man comes down from violent rage after the an occurrence resident on misaddressed letter. Baby emerges from game of peekaboo wiser, more reflective. Man commits to being overly niche for next 45 minutes to friend he just snapped at. Childhood friend reluctantly checked in on. Waiter asks if couple would like to pack him up in little box and take him home for later. Man doesn't mind long commute because it gives him extra time to listen to voice in head saying he can't keep living like this. Coffee made, bowed, consumed without single conscious thought. Man hoping people notice how many folding chairs he's carrying at once. College freshman decides to be lanyard wearing kind. Man not sure why he thought most psychologically taxing situation of his life would be the thing to make him productive. Depressed dad can't even enjoy teenage daughter's new haircut. Man reaches first of dozens of breaking points to come. Family can trace ancestry back to whatever the hell grandma was talking about. Man reminds self woman on cheeky to banana sticker only smiling at him because that's her job. Guy in criminal law class needs to shut the fuck up. Man scrambling to furnish apartment before date shows up. Mother still searching for preschool that focuses exclusively on her daughter. Neurosurgeon feels lucky he was able to turn hobby into career. Occupation drop down menu forces man to scroll past list of every existing job ever before he can select unemployed. Pathetic minimum wage worker devastated about losing job that only paid couple hundred dollars a week anyway. Recipe calls for a banana as if woman has access to fucking Caribbean street market. Report. Make it stop. Rewind. 10 sharp knives that scarred you for life. Russian roulette champion wouldn't let his daughter play Russian roulette. Self-isolated woman going so crazy she's started talking to her spouse. Unclear why only one half of couple wearing mask. Sometimes you feel like I'm the only one who gives a shit about rich. Lost who here. Study. Depression hits losers hardest. Typo in Proposition 8 defines marriage as between one man and one wolfman. Undaunted terse bean waitress has been expecting to die there for the past two years anyway. Well, I could do that, says Art Museum attendee viewing security guard on lunch break. Serial killer nostalgic for bygone days when he could still get excited by something as simple as setting a dog on fire. Welcome to très bien. May I know the living shit out of you? Wincing, screaming that feels searing pain in head every time daughter across country wears sock with hole in it. Bido altes homosexual scared to king my cock. You a pumpkin headed bitch, announces bus teenager.